Hey, what is up guys? So the other day I had the opportunity to go out in a snowstorm and kind of film myself driving in the snow, talking about how it handles some of the performance aspects in the snow. And kind of the whole reason behind this video is there's so many videos online of people with rear wheel drive BMWs with like really crappy summer tires trying to drive in the snow and they're like, oh, look how bad it is. I should have got an Audi instead. But really with the all wheel drive, this car is absolutely amazing in the snow. So just a few little facts about my car before we get started. It is a 2006 330XI and I only have all season tires so they're not even winter tires and you can see just how well it does. And uh, guys I apologize if it's dark. I did want to wait until a little later so that there wouldn't be as much traffic. Safety is my main concern here. So anyway, in six inches of snow so far it's going without any hesitation whatsoever. It feels like I'm driving on drive pavement right now. Okay, I'm pulling out onto a main road here. See the traction control kick in a little bit if I kind of put my foot into it. All right, so now I'm on a back road and this is pretty deep snow I would say still probably four inches at least covering the surface of the road uh, this road doesn't get a whole lot of traffic so and still it's just going without any hesitation um, I feel totally confident driving right now uh, and like I said before in a different video um, I'm not too sure about uh, Subaru or Audi how they handle in the snow but I would probably stack this car up uh, just as well as those, especially if you put all uh, winter tires on here. This is only with all seasons and it's doing just fine. So I'm doing about 45 right now into these turns. So I'll put it into third gear here and we'll see uh, if we can accelerate a little bit. Yeah, it picks up without any hesitation at all. All right, so I'm just gonna try to see. I'm gonna only go up to 50 right now, but I'm just stopped. So here we go. See how quickly we can accelerate. Okay, and there's 50. I'm not gonna go any faster than that. All right, so as far as tires go, I personally don't think that you need winter tires if you have all-wheel drive. Um, I've just got regular all-seasons on here and they're doing just fine. Definitely if you have rear wheel, I would recommend it, but for this car, it seems like even with the back wheels, they're actually 10 inches wide, which actually is kind of a huge disadvantage. You want a more narrow tire for snow, but even with the 10 inch wheels in the back and the all-season tires, this is performing just fine. All right, for those of you who are wondering if it's possible to do a donut with the all-wheel drive, it is possible. You just have to find this button that says DTC. Hold that down for about three seconds. You'll see a little light come up that says DSC inactive. That means that the traction control system isn't gonna kick in. That way you can kind of give it some more throttle and just kind of do donuts, I guess. So here it goes. So anyway, to answer the question, should you drive your BMW in the snow? Absolutely, it is so much fun, especially with the all-wheel drive. Um, if you have a rear-wheel drive BMW, I do recommend getting those winter tires on there. Just invest the money, it'll be a lot safer that way, but for the all-wheel drive ones, you'll be just fine with the all-season tires. So for this week's question is just what kind of tires do you have? If you have a rear-wheel drive car or a all-wheel drive car, just let me know in the comments whether you use all seasons or if you actually go out and get the winter tires for it. 
Um, if you want, you can leave a, a kind of mention the brand that you like. That's always good to know. And anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.